Hello there beautiful people, I hope you do well and welcome back again to On How channel. For people that don't know, my name is Anest, I'm working for you, so if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop on below in a comment and I will be happy to make a video for you. And for people that do know, welcome back and please be a witness for that for over 150 or over 200 now videos on Shopify customization because they were mostly requested by you guys, I mean subscribers and some people not even subscribers but I'm fine with that, I still make the video for them as always. Just a like button, that's all I'm asking. Or actually, if you are interested in Shopify customization, you want to be an expert, you want to learn how to do anything yourself without having to hire a developer, why not subscribe to the channel, man? I don't have anything to sell. I don't sell any courses, never will. I don't have any paid memberships on the channel. So every little thing I do create, I post it completely free on the channel, including the codes I do share and the tutorials I do show you how to implement those codes. So it's a win-win situation, but I'll let you choose. Now respect your decision. Just a like button, that's all I'm asking if this video helped you out. If it didn't, just drop me a comment as I said, I will be happy to make an update for you or provide you with information you need in order to do the thing you're trying to do. And here I am again back with the most requested video actually, which is how to add the shaking effect on the add to cart button and buy now button on your Shopify store. And yes, you heard that right. That shaking effect that many uh, premium teams have it. No worries, I got you. I will show you how to do that completely free just to the free teams. I mean all of them. This will work for every free Shopify teams because we will use our own custom code that I did create and I did make sure that it works for them all. So even if you cannot afford the premium teams, no worries, you can afford me, I'm completely free. That's a good quote, right? <laughs> and without any more talking, let's just jump to it. As you can see, this is the Shopify dashboard in here and they have down team, which is the one I do demonstrations on. So every call I do create, I do demonstration in the videos on down team because it's the most requested one and also is the most used one. But if I scroll down in here, I have every other free most used teams, which is Refresh, Spotlight, Taste, Sense and Trade. And if you are wondering why is that, because I do actually try my calls behind the scenes, as I mentioned previously, on all of these teams. So even if you're not using down team, you're using one of these, should work for you just fine. Even if it didn't, just drop me a comment. I would be happy to help you out, as I said. And I don't try the calls on all of these teams in the video, so I don't bore people. Because it's gonna be like half hour video or more. So I only do demonstration on down team. And I have to say this in the beginning, so I give you that peace of mind. Because you're gonna see me doing it on down team. You might be thinking, oh, maybe it's not working for the others. No, it is. And here is your peace of mind. And without the way, let's just get to it and show you how to add the shaking effect on the hover for the buy it now and add to cart button on your Shopify store. And this is the Shopify store where I do all the tricks. So this is the Shopify store where I do all the tutorials. So everything that you see in the Shopify store, literally everything, every little thing, I did it in tutorials. So if you saw anything that you like, you think it looks good and you want to implement it in your store as well, then just check out the channel. Because once it's here, that means it's already done with one of my previous videos. Because I don't remove the changes from here, I keep them so people can see them. But what I'm talking about in this video is shaking effects. So let's just access this product for example. And here is this one for example. Once I hover over the, over the add to cart as well as the buy now button, it needs to shake. So I will show you in this video how to add the shaking effect on these both buttons. And as I said, it works for everything. And if you are interested in how to make this uh, like this or the rounded corners product pictures, I mean everything, just check out the channel. Everything as I said, I did on the Shopify store, I did it in tutorials. So obviously we will keep this page open, do the trick and come back and see it in action. So get back to Shopify dashboard. If you are already in Shopify dashboard, simply click on online store teams and click on the three dots on left of customize and click on edit code. It will take you to the code editor for your Shopify team. And in here we need to find the specific file. Instead of looking at the folders, you might get dizzy or something. Simply use the search bar at the top left corner. And again, I have to repeat this for the million times now. So it's going to be either base.css or team.css or style.css and some rarely custom made teams going to be custom.css. But as I said, either base.css or team.css or style.css. Most of the teams now use base.css. Simply type in base in the search bar and it will show you base.css as you can see. Click on it, make sure it ends with CSS. 
uh, just a dollar every time instead of CSS, I'm, I might be rich. So scroll all the way down. Let me drag this because it's huge fine. And by the way, interested in removing this uh, scroll bar from your Shopify store? I already made that video. So <laughs> I will quit now, I promise. So scroll all the way down. After that, uh, we need to create some space in here in order to paste in our code. And there is no space in here. To create that space, simply click front of the last thing here, which is in my case is closing bracket. Then hit enter on your keyboard, the key enter I mean. And here we go. We have a completely new line to paste in our code, as I said. And where are you gonna get that code? You need to hire a developer, pay him, wait 24 hours, then he get back to you with the code, then get back to this video. I'll be waiting here. I'm just joking again. Scroll down the description box and you will see a link named this code. Click on it. And it will take you to this beautiful page right here with this beautiful code. And again, this code is completely free. No pay please, no share please, not like that. Just a like button, that's all I'm asking. And a beautiful comment if you can. I would really appreciate it. So <laughs> simply select the whole code in here. Make sure to select the whole thing. And again, this will do the trick for both of us. Uh, both, I mean, <laughs> both of us. Both the add to cart as well as buy it now button. Right click, copy, this is just a comment. Yeah, you can, yeah, you can select as well, no worries. Just make sure you select the closing bracket as well. Right click, copy, get back in here and paste it at the bottom of the file. Make sure you do that. And after that, click on the save button. We will wait for a couple of seconds. Boom, it's saved. It. We will get back in here, reload the page and see the magic happens. Okay, now it's fine. But once I hover over it, oh, it's shaking as well as the bite now. And it will keep shaking once the cursor is on top of it. Same as the add to cart again, as you can see. And both of them, and without using any apps, and without paying any developer, and without waiting 24 hours, it's all free. So hit that like button. And that's how you add the shaking effect on add to cart as well as buy it now on your Shopify product page. And if you have any questions, make sure to drop them below. But for now, I think my job is done. So thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.